Welcome back to another video. Wow, it's been so long since I've been in front of a camera. Right now, I'm currently editing the video you are about to watch, but I just want to let you guys know that. So, in today's video, practically what we are doing in today's video is we're going to PetSmart, I mean Petco, and we are buying these crabs. Now, um, I'm buying hermit crabs just because Tarzan, um, hermit crabs love to live in groups, and I'm not going to have him just living all by himself. I feel like that would be kind of mean. Um, and I don't support buying crabs. There is a disclaimer later on this video that I will put out. But again, don't support buying crabs. But if you have one, you do have to have them in groups. So just buy two more. And then after that, you have to just let them pass along. Um, I'm not just gonna, I just feel bad keeping Tarzan by himself because they are supposed to be in groups. And yes, I did have to buy them from Petco because they're all wild caught anyways. They all come from the same place. So this is the only time I will say I had to buy from Petco, and I will admit to it. I'm sorry, guys, but I had to. Um, I hope you guys do understand. I hope you guys do respect this. Um, if you don't, make sure to leave in the comments nicely. Um, and I will definitely, I definitely understand all your points. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put you into the driving montage, and then I'll see you guys at the disclaimer part, and then at home. So yeah, peace out. <laughs> We just got the crab in the car. You can see one climbing right there, and then we got another in the bucket right there. And then we have a whole bag of supplies, um, just some extra stuff for the tank that I bought. Um, but I just want to go over why I bought them from Petco now. The reason I did buy them from Petco is because no other place had them. And the thing with crabs is they are so good. And as you guys know, I have one. I'm not going to make him live his life out and pass away alone. So I got these two, and I promise after these crabs pass away i will not be getting any more crabs because i don't want to support the wild caught industry but don't worry um i had to buy them guys because i didn't want tarzan to live alone that's just mean so we bought these crabs yes i know they're wild caught and yes i'm going to try to get them out of the painted shells i bought new shells for them um this guy actually needs to molt into a bigger shell pretty soon but he's climbing you can see um so the minute they get out of these painted shells they will get thrown away the painted shells um so yeah i just want to let you guys know that I did have to buy them from Petco, and when we get home, I'll do a, like a haul on everything we got, and I'll show you guys the crabs more in depth, and we're going to give them a soak. That's what you do when you get crabs from a new place, but you can see this guy's climbing right there, so I'm going to, and then the other guy's down there, so I'm going to close up this box, but I just want to let you guys know a bit of the disclaimer. I don't recommend buying crabs at all, just because they're all wild caught, which kind of stinks, so I don't recommend buying crabs because they're all wild caught, but I mean... Sorry, there's a lady staring at me. We're at the gas station right now. But I had to do it because I wanted Tarzan to have friends. Like I said, after these crabs do pass away, I'm probably not going to be getting any more. Which I know could be seven years because crabs live pretty long. But, um, yeah, thank you guys for understanding. And if you got any comments, concerns, or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below about, like, me buying from Peko or anything. But I'll see you guys at home when I show you the haul. Sorry for that. Such a long disclaimer. Look at this guy. He's such a climber. See you guys at home. Hey guys so we just got home now we're going to show you what we got so first thing we obviously got is the hermit crab themselves you can probably hear them scraping actually at the um container and i'm going to open this up very carefully and as i see there is okay both of them are just kind of vibing in there so we're just going to shut this back up um just to make sure they don't like escape why i'm going through the rest of the hall sorry if you hear people in the background it's a house for respect um next thing we got we're going to get a little crush feeding later on. We got some rosy red minnows. Um, we're going to get a bit of a crush feeding later on. Like I said, I did shop at Petco. I already sh showed you guys that disclaimer. I'm sorry. I had to. I didn't want Tarzan to live alone. It's really bad for him to live alone. We got this tree. I was thinking I could put this, like, in the middle because the lady at the pet store, these were all attached to the tree. But obviously, I'm going to wash it off. Next thing we got is in this Petco bag. We have... Their new food dish. I thought this would be nice because it's like all open, so I can put like salad over here, like um protein over here, and like grain in the middle, which is what um hermit crabs like. And then I got some shells for them. Um, got this type because they both actually look like they need a molt. This type, and then we got this type. So as you can hear, they're pretty loud. So let's get them in their new tank now. I think what you guys are going to be asking is quarantine and stuff like that. Um, 
The reason I'm not too, too worried about it is because these the lady said they've had these in the store for two months now. I know you're never supposed to trust Pekka Worker, but we kind of related on something. She had a turtle. She had a boot on skink. She was pretty chill, so she was one of those knowledgeable pet smart workers, which, don't get me wrong, there's not a lot of those, but um, I am going to take her word for this. And, yeah, we're just going to open this box. We're going to push down these Pekka boxes. Hey guys, so we got the crabs here. You can see one is climbing out of the box. We're going to set up my tripod. So what we're going to do is we're just going to gently, sorry if you guys can't see it. I know it's kind of hard, but gently pull this guy out and show him to the camera. So he's kind of stuck to the box, as you can see. So I'm just trying to slowly let him... This guy is free again. Sorry for the bad lighting. So you guys can see. Comment down below names for him. Please don't go off the painted shells because they will be out of them pretty soon. You guys can see him right there. We're going to put him in his new tank. We're just going to put him right there. Sorry guys for the noise. That's why I'm driving away. But you can see him right there. Um... Let me get a light on this tank so you guys can see better. I got my phone flashlight, that should help a bit. You can see him um, crawling away right there. Now we're gonna get our other buddy out here. Yes, I just get, did get three. Um, just because of the fact that I feel like three is a good number. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna pull him out. Here is the other one again. We need names, don't buy, go buy the painted shell cause they won't be in the painted shell too, too, too long. Now, I don't know where the other one actually went. But, sure, he is on his adventure. Actually, he just went in this house with Tarzan, you can see. So, you guys can see that Tarzan is right there. You guys can kind of see he's in his big house. You guys can see him right there, kind of. And then we got the other crab here. And I'm looking for where the other crab went. But I guess we'll find them later. So now, next, we got to set up our food dish. So... I mean, our quad edition, stuff like that. So, I'm gonna put this light up there so you guys can just see better. Move this over here. So, next thing we got is our food dish, like I said. So, I'm just gonna peel this food tag off. And, here we go. You can give it a rinse if you want. I'm gonna go rinse this and this, and I'll be back in a second. Okay, now that I rinsed them both and dried them, um, this tag did not wanna mop, but. We are going to put them in. So we're also going to put the shells in. Um, but you can see that we're just, I don't know where the other hermit crab actually went. Like at all. I don't know at all where he went. So we're just going to move these shells and we're going to put the food dish right up front in the middle. Just so it's easier for me to feed them. It's actually a really nice looking food dish too. I really do like this food dish, but we're just going to. Here we're gonna move our other crab just over there. And we're gonna put the food dish just right there. Now I'm still looking for the other crab. I think he went in the house with Tarzan. Um, because I see Tarzan in there, but I don't see I think the other crab may be in there too. So we got our food dish there. Salt water, fresh water dish. I know I need to get a bigger fresh water dish, and I'm getting a bigger tank for these guys eventually. Um, this is good for now. Um, trust me guys, I am Pretty, I do my research with my hermit crabs. Um, I know a lot of you probably don't think I do, but I do. Um, we washed the shells out too. Let's put some of these shells in. They love climbing over the shells too, so that's pretty nice for them because then they can climb over them. And they are pretty stubborn. Like if they don't find the right shell, they won't molt. So we should have enough shells in there. And now it's time to add our nice looking tree. Yeah, I do see the other crab. He's actually in this cork house with Tarzan, guys. And so we're just going to put this blueberry in here. But we're going to move this guy so we can put our tree smack dab in the middle. Because they love climbing. And they also love enclosures that are, like, actually crowded. Like this, believe it or not. You guys may not believe that. But do your own research. I'm just going to this camera so you guys can see. Hmm. You guys go. But believe it or not, crabs actually love tanks that are semi-crowded. If you don't believe it, look it up on Google or 
Um, I think you can just look it up on YouTube too. It's because this helps them feel safe and secure and all that stuff like stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so we should move. Put our tree right, just right in the middle, just like that. And there we go. Then we can move this. We can kind of just like move it more up here. And then kind of like bring that back. And our tree is in now. And put our crab just like right under this. We can move it around just like that. And we got all our stuff on our tree is in now, which is great. I'm super happy about this purchase of this tree thing. And our food dish is in. Here is the new and improved upgraded crab tank. Like I said, we got all our shells are mixed around and it looks just like they would in the wild. A nice foresty environment. I'm gonna fill up the freshwater dish and clean this dish. But what do you guys think of this crab attack? I think it looks really nice. And I think for three pretty small crabs, this will be great for them. Like I said, we're gonna get rid of this box. Just make sure there's no crabs in there. There we go. Um, we're gonna get rid of this box, but okay, all I wanted to say, guys, is this crab that was in this tank that like we put over here did end up going. I did change the saltwater dish and the freshwater dish. I just wanted to put that up there. They're gonna get some new food this morning. They just got fed. Um, I'm probably gonna feed them actually today. So yeah, I just wanted to put that out there. I also wanted to say that thank you guys for watching another one of my videos if you guys want more of my content are you guys ever sitting there and you just want more my zoo content well i got you i made an extra channel literally called my zoo extras and it will be first link in the top of the description so if you ever want my more my zoo content like gaming story time just like random pictures and collages of my pets well then head on over to that channel link in the description first link in the description and then if you ever need to watch a my zoo video i post on there almost daily gaming videos so yeah if you want more of my content go check out that video but yeah these crabs are i'm gonna let them settle in guys thank you guys for watching another one of my videos if you guys did enjoy make sure to drop a like smash subscribe when we're on our road to 190 subs which is absolutely crazy drop a comment on something if you made it this far in the video comment down below some name suggestions for the crabs and i'll see you guys on the next one make sure you do your research and i'm out peace